Could you just give us an update on uh, the injury situation with both Luke Shaw, who went off and the other night, and Christian Eriksson, who the club have been showing pictures of training? Yes. <coughs> Um, yeah, Luke Shaw is not available for tomorrow, and yeah, we have to see how we'll progress to to coming week. And the good news is Christian Eriksen back in training, and he will be back tomorrow in the squad. It's it's been a long time since Christian played. He had a huge impact on the, on the team before he got injured. How how big a a bit of news is that given you coming into the key part of the season? Yeah, I think it was not for nothing. I was so angry about that bad tackle. Um, and yeah, he was away. And we first we were we feared he, that we lost him for the whole season, but uh, he worked very well. I think the medical department did really well. And in togetherness, um, he's already returning into the squad and so available for the final stages of the season. So what is, yeah, we are very pleased with that. You did think you, you wouldn't get him again? For the first, it was a really bad tackle and it was a really also a bad injury. He had, but um, yeah, he's a little bit ahead of the shadow. Um, so yeah, we are very happy with him. James, <coughs> Eric, you got the passion that you wanted from the players the other night and got the result. How do you keep that passion now switched on throughout the rest of the season? Uh, yeah. <laughs> it's, um, yeah, you have to do it every, every game and that needs preparation, and, but it has to be the standard when you are playing for Manchester United, so there's a demand, so no but if, <laughs> you have to do it. And that's a responsibility that the player has to deliver when you are playing for Manchester United, so you have to be accountable. You've beaten Everton twice already this season, That they were a different Everton then. How, how have they changed and what are they doing differently now under Sean Dyche? No, it's, it's obviously uh, a manager doing a great job. team is really fit from Everton. Uh, they, they, so the physical output is outstanding, so we have to match that. Sky. There's a lot of talk that Sean at Everton has built their mental strength up, and I know something that's, that's something you are very keen on as well. How do you, how do you build your team's mental strength? What do you do? Uh, it's about demands, <coughs> and so and we have to to match standards uh, always, and it's about um, it's about a culture uh, that you only can be a player for Manchester United when you match those standards, and you have to do it always. And it's not about so once, because um, players, so when you are not in the absolutely top, uh, they can do it once. But from a player who's playing in the top, uh, so competing for trophies, competing for winning uh, Premier League, yeah, you have to do it always so consistent. And is that something that you and your coaching staff can do, or do, or do you get to a point where you're bringing in outside experts to help, maybe? Yeah, of course, that's our job, <laughs> to, to bring that mentality in. Uh, PA. Uh, yeah. Hi, Eric. I'm just wondering, um, any more uh, injuries? Anyone uh, available, not available tomorrow? No. no. It was, um, I think, uh, so Shaw is not available. Yeah. Christian Eriksen is back in the squad. And for the rest, we have, um, you know, we have a squad, uh, what is, I think, what's ready to play.